Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to add Google Analytics to your WordPress theme. Um, I've seen a lot of people use like plugins and just add it to the head PHP of their theme files. I'm going to show you a little bit different way. I think it's uh, one of the best ways to do it. So, first thing you need of course is some Google Analytics tracking code. You can go over to google.com slash analytics, sign up for an account, and it should give you uh, the tracking code once you set up an account. If you already have an account set up and uh, you're looking for where the tracking code is, you can go down here to admin and then go to tracking info and then tracking code. So I'm going to grab this code right here and that's going to be the tracking code that I implement into my theme. So how I normally do it is in my theme files, I uh, you can add this to your functions file but I normally break it out like I've discussed in other um, tutorials. But I have this INC folder and I'm going to add a new file here and I'm just going to save this in the INC and then I'm just going to call this tracking.php so in this file is where I normally add all my different tracking codes maybe it's the Facebook tracking conversion pixel Google Analytics and whatever else you might be wanting to track so in here I'm going to open up some PHP tags just to get this file going and then I'm going to right ahead go into creating a function I'm going to call it put the prefix of my theme help WP and then put Google underscore analytics so open that up and since we're adding some script tags we need to close this PHP and then of course open it again down here so now that we have uh, the PHP tags closed we can actually add our script in right here So that's our Google Analytics script and what I want to do is add it to the head PHP or the header.php and I'm going to grab, I'm going to use an action called WP underscore head and uh, it'll automatically place it right up here for me. So that way uh, the analytics code is up high in our theme so it'll do the best kind of tracking for us. So right under this uh, right after this opening PHP tag what we want to do is do an add action WP underscore head and then whatever our function name is in this case it'll be help underscore Google underscore analytics and close that right there so of course you probably want to add some comments so you know a developer that comes behind you will understand what's going on in this file so let's save that file and then we need to make sure our theme knows about this file so we need to go over to functions and then this is where I normally add it but you can add it wherever you want I just need to call that file call it tracking codes then it's in my INC tracking. So now when we go to our theme and we refresh and we inspect, if we go up to uh, the head of our file here, you see the script tag, and then we now have Google Analytics inserted into our theme so it'll start tracking for us automatically. So I hope you enjoyed that tutorial on how to add Google Analytics to your WordPress theme without using a plugin or without hacking up your head your header.php file. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask in the comments below.